Hey guys, so today's video is going to be my hair and makeup tutorial for the 4th of July. And I know even though I'm not living in America, I live in England, um, I thought since I have a lot of American viewers that this would be really useful. So, And even if not, I mean I think it's a cute look. So yeah, I'm going to start with the makeup um, tutorial. So the first thing you're going to want to do is find any sort of silver eyeshadow. It can be like glittery or matte, it really doesn't matter too much for this look. I mean, I would recommend glittery, but, um, and my eyeshadow that I'm using is from Seventeen. And you're going to take any sort of eyeshadow brush and kind of, you want to pat it along near where you put your eyeliner, so like towards the lower half of your eyelid. And then as you can see, I'm kind of gently blending it upwards. And that's going to create kind of like a smudgy kind of like gradient almost, and it's going to be really pretty. And so next you're going to take sort of any darker eyeshadow. I'm taking like an off black, and this is from a NYX palette. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to do kind of the same thing. I'm patting this along my um, lash line. And that's going to kind of add to like the smudgy effect. Um, I think this step is kind of optional though. Okay, so next you're going to want to find a blue eyeshadow, and mine is from Seventeen. And what you're going to do is you're going to take any sort of small eyeshadow brush. I think that is from, actually I'm not really sure, but um, you're going to apply that along your lower lash line. And you can do that as thinly or like thickly as you want. Um, obviously if you're going for a more dramatic look, I would do it a bit more thick. But, um, okay, so next I'm taking a liquid eyeliner, and <laughs> again, I'm not really sure where that's from, but you can take anything. You could use pencil if you wanted. And I'm just going to apply this along my upper lash line. And if you wanted this to be even more dramatic, I would recommend doing it thicker and with a bit more of a wing at the end. And, yeah, hopefully from the blue you can tell I'm going for, like, the red, white, and blue theme, but, yeah, you'll see where the red comes in later. <laughs> Yay! So now it's time for mascara, and I'm taking the Volume Million Lashes from L'Oreal, and I'm just applying this on my eyelashes. <laughs> so, I mean, you could go with fake lashes if you wanted. I mean, go for it. But, yeah, I'm just kind of taking this all over, and I've, like, smudged everywhere, but that doesn't matter. So, um, next I'm taking bronzer, and I'm going to use that on my cheeks instead of blush because um, I don't want it to be, like, too much color. So I'm just taking this with a blusher brush. I'm pretty sure that's from the body shop if you're wondering. And I'm just going to kind of, I mean, I'm like attempting to contour my cheekbones, but it's really more to just get some color on your cheeks. So, I mean, you could, you could put a blush if you wanted, but that's just what I'm taking. Did I say it was from NARS? Yeah, it's NARS Laguna bronzer. So yeah. Um, if you were going to use a blush, I'd recommend like maybe a coral. Oh, okay. So now I'm on to lip. And um, I tried to like give you options, so you could either go with like a tinted lip balm for the most subtle look, or you could go for a gloss or a lipstick. So I think you can guess which one I went for. Um, obviously, red lipstick is pretty dramatic, and I'm sure some of you are like completely shocked at how I'm applying it. But I mean, I'm just. I don't think it's necessary to take like loads of lip liner, oh my god, sorry, that's my phone, or like um, a lip brush, but yeah, that's it. So hopefully you enjoyed that makeup tutorial. So now we're on to the outfit. So this is the fun part. Um, there I am. Okay, so for my shorts, those are from Topshop, they're like the American flag ones. And for my top, I'm pretty sure that's from H&M, and my shoes are from New Look. So, I mean, I just tried to grab anything that had red, white, or blue, and I had stuff with American flags on it, so that was perfect. Um, but honestly, I would just go for that color scheme, and you're pretty good. So, and my hair's in a ponytail, but you can wear it down. And I didn't actually have any accessories. I mean, you could, like, wear Star Spangled Bangles! <laughs> okay, sorry. But, um, <laughs> yeah, so now I'm taking my hair down, and that's what the outfit looks like with hair down. So yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you have an awesome 4th of July. Thanks for watching. Bye! Happy 4th of July! Hello. <laughs> Damn. <laughs>